Fallout 4 has just dropped a new update. It's a next gen update for, I think, PS5, Xbox, PC. I've got some bug fixes and things like that. Following the success of the series, Fallout has dropped a new update. They're trying to continue the hot streak that they're on at the moment. It seems to be all Fallout this month. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into this and see what this new update's about. War. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. That introduction always gets me, man. It's so powerful. War never changes. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. I'm just gonna quickly build my character and then I'll come back in a second. Okay, I think that's the uh, character about done. I mean, I haven't made too many drastic changes. I mean, I've kept it fairly basic, but I've given him a beard, changed up his facial structure a little bit, but yeah, man, he's looking good. He's looking good. Move. Hello, sweetheart. Oh, look at that ass. Hey, hon. Hey, huh? Hmm, just getting ready. Oh, she's getting ready. She don't want to hear it. She don't want to hear me. Okay. Where we go? Codsworth, my guy. I haven't seen you in a little while. Ah, good morning, sir. What are we Your saying? Coffee. Thank you very much, sir. 173.5 degrees ah. Fahrenheit. Rule to perfection. Just how I like it. And today's newspaper... Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My Where's, favorite. Where's the newspaper over here? Hmm. More of the same. While we, before we continue, I know a lot of people like to have, um, what do we call it? Subtitles. Uh, we'll just put both of them on, see how it goes. Hey, what do you want me to do? Oh, she's coming. Hello. Are you ready for me now, babe? Hello? Okay, she's got her own newspaper. Hey, don't speak to me. Nervous? Don't be. Everyone's gonna love the speech. Now, oh, sound like someone made a sticky. I shall attend to young Sean. 
You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. Huh? Anything? No? I believe it's almost Halloween. <sighs> Need to finish making Sean's costume. It's, it's weird that how... Uh, the time of recording, we're essentially on the brink of war, so it's, it's scary how similar reality is could be to this game with all the stuff that's going on in the world at the moment. It's, it's scary to think about. You know, we could be sitting here enjoying our time, watching the TV, and all of a sudden, boom. It's probably that salesman. He comes for you every day. Explosion. Hello, hello, sir. Good morning. Good morning. Voltec calling. Vault Tech, go on. Yeah, we don't want to hear Vault Tech, but go on. Go on. Nice to find you, sir. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language. The big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid. And coming sooner than you may think. If you catch my meaning... Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a... Uh, mm -hmm, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Is there enough space for us? Because, you know, we're a big family. Two people and a, and a baby, so... Is there enough space? But there's room for my entire family, right? Of course. Of course. Minus your robot, naturally. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. I guess we need to know what's going on, so I guess I'm going to go tell me more. Or I can be sarcastic with him. I think, let me take a minute to, to just say about the um, the text as well. So a lot of people didn't like how the text played out and that you had a voice character and things like that. I don't mind it. I don't mind having the voice character. I think it's quite cool. But... I'm, uh, anyway, well, in a bit of a he's rush. He's talking out of me. <laughs> the, the text here, however, is not clear what you're going to say. Like, what does sarcastic mean? Like, how are you going to be sarcastic? So, I get why people are annoyed with that. But we're going to go with tell me more. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. I'm going to be sarcastic with him. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait for the world to end. <laughs> That's the spirit. Now, let's see. Ooh. I forgot about this. So me, I, I always put it into um, speech for the most part. So charisma. But I'm not going to put... You want a couple in strength. Perception. Okay. Luck is measured in general good fortune and effects. Recharge rate of critical hit. Okay, you need a bit of luck. Need a bit of luck in life. Endurance is a minute. Oh, okay, we'll just take that as well. Perception. It's very difficult to know what you want at the start. I, c I can't remember what's good and what's not so good. Um, that sounds good, though. It looks good. We'll go for that. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just going to walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Cheers, mate. Thank hey, you. It's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Sir, 
Sean has been changed, but he oh, he looks scary though. refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> you heard Codsworth. Hey kids, Don't squeeze worry. past. Hello, Sean. How are we? <laughs> He'll either be great at spelling or great at smashing blocks together. Hello. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Why she just spawn me? Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. And do what? And do what exactly? Sir? Mum? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Oh no. I didn't even get to finish my conversation. Maybe that was a bit rude for followed Alec. By, yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with say? our affiliate stations. We do, oh, we no. do have, we do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my God. We, we need to get to the vault now. Let's go, 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 go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if yeah. you are registered. Could you imagine sitting at home, chilling, thinking about going to the park and all of a sudden you're running away from a nuclear explosion? Explosion, that's crazy. I'll help you! Oh, I can't help you. Sorry. Thanks for pointing away, sir. You're doing a great job. Out of the way, Vault Man. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant. Adult male. Adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Thank you. You two, follow me. Come on. What's going to happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? everything we can. Now keep this moving. Way. Okay, you're running too slow, sir. Sir, we need to send you down to the vault. Step on the platform. Step on the platform in the center. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! That is scary. That is a scary fall. That is a scary fall. Hold on! We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later... No, no, we don't. Be. Don't get caught up thinking about that. You're oh, come on, lad. Come on. Everyone Move a bit slower, you know? The the right, I'm, I'm overtaking you. Come in. Hello. Step over to the table. Take a You'll seat. need your seats before way, we can please. take you further. Thank you so much. Uh, thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. Just this hey. way. All right, it's down three. the hallway follow right me. there. Hey, let's go. See? Oh, this is our new home. Well, it's gone. Oh, you're gonna it's love it here. Every this third, is yeah. one of our most Remember advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, oh, mind you. What if they didn't make it? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Oh, Just a few medical oh, items we have to get through first. I was wondering who was speaking for a second. Off the list as they come in. Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Hey, this way, please. Just step in here and put your vault suit on. 
and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five. As soon as I get out of here, he's done. He's done. I see your face, my guy. I see your face. You better pray for a miracle because I'm coming for you. How dare you kill my babe? Take my kid as well. I forgot about that. I mean, there's not much we could do, she's just got shot in the head. I'll find who did this, and I'll get Sean back. It always amuses me. It always amuses me how he has this massive panic about getting her out. As soon as he opens it, he, he's really calm. I'll get, I'll get them back. I promise. Anything for me in here? Malfunction in emergency exit door override. Please we'll take all that. We'll take the junk for now. For service. We get our first um Ooh, little radroach, hello. We get our first um community really quickly. I don't know what common they're called. Settlements is the one I was looking for. So we can just store all this junk. Oh, it's anything. And that'll give us a little head start. Hopefully. Let's move on. Oh, they're in here. They're in here. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. What are you saying? Where's the other one? Giant. Roaches? What the hell? Oh yeah, I forgot he doesn't know what's going on. That would be quite weird, coming out and seeing all these massive creatures. Like, could you imagine coming out and seeing like, a huge spider? Like, I'll shoot myself in the head. I would absolutely kill myself. Hello, are you gonna get zapped up? Come on. 
before this guy dies. Yeah, he's, he's done for. There we go. All right, we don't want to get zapped. Come on. Then. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Hello, good sir. Calm your jets. What happened here? Where is everyone? Oh, there's more. There's more. There's more. Come on, come on, come on. Oh. I need a weapon. Oh, God provides. Hello. Okay, 50 ammo. Is this all that's left? Not great. Oh. There's more. Oh, I really nice. want this. Coming back later for you. I always get jealous when I see this, and I can never ever get it. Thank you. Preserve cigarette pack. Anything else for me in here? Some more rounds. Absolutely perfect. Radix. I don't think there's much more in here. That I can remember. We can uh, go in here, open the door. Okay. Boom. Now we've got some weapons. It's gonna be a little bit different from Fallout 76. The VAT system is a lot different. A lot better. If it actually works. Oh. oh, get out! How many are there? Right, let's move up, move up, move up. I can still hear one. Rattling around. Maybe it's just like I'm just hearing things. Right. Is anyone alive? Did anyone get out? Hello, hello. How do I miss from there? How do I miss two shots from there? Tell a pit boy. Okay, so now we have access to our inventory, all the junk, aid, all that stuff. We've got the two wedding rings, okay. There's not much that we can do with that at the moment. Let's get out of here. Get out. Let me leave, man. Come on! Can't even do a uh, slide in this game. Freedom! Oh, no. hello, no, no, no. Finish. Up we go. Your to the, to the fresh air. For choosing Vault Tech, 
I say fresh air, it's probably not fresh air, it's probably heavily irradiated air. But I expect them to be stuck in a vault. I think the concept of this the start is really good. Like you start in this in your town where everything's good, it's all it's all great, and then in contrast to now where everything's just destroyed. Could you imagine like if this was real life and how you'd be thinking after coming out of vault and seeing your house and your area absolutely decimated? And your wife being shot in the head as well doesn't help. I think there's something in here if I remember correctly. Alright, we've got some runaway. That's the vault 11. Uh, that's the vault 11 entry point. I don't know if that actually does anything. No. Oh, oh, something does do something. Oh! I've pressed something. Very nice. Let's move on up! Moving on now. We're moving on now. Time to kill some ghouls. Nothing can stop me. Ah, we're taking that. There's a ball cap there. Let's go. Back home. Oh. We'll take you. Is there another one there? Oh. No. Where's that from? A hub flower. Good old sanctuary. Codsworth, where are we at, my guy? Are you still here? Yes, you are. Things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Dak. Where is your better half, by the by? She's. I mean, I, I, I don't want to say wife, wife's killers, but I can say a better place. You know what I mean? It's, it's more of a fitting end. She's in a better place. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, uh, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? No, he's not. But have you seen Codsworth, him? listen to me carefully. Have you seen him? Have you seen Sean? Why, the, the missus had him last, remember? Oh, perhaps she's gone to the Parker residence to arrange a play date. I'm sure she'll be back with him momentarily. Sean's he's been kidnapped. Been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? Imagine, imagine someone telling you you've been in a cryostasis for 200 years. 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. 
<laughs> you must be famished. But we take care of our guys, you know what I mean? We have to ask them if you're okay. Godsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. <laughs> and the car, the car! How do you polish rust? <laughs> what do you know? What do you know, Codsworth? I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were... dead. I did find this hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you. As a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. A holotape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pip boy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. Now, Enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The Mrs. and young Shaw may turn up yet. Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual, sir. Pesky neighborhood dogs and mosquitoes. Shall I investigate? All right, let's do this. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, sir. Why we do that? We'll listen to this. Oopsie. <laughs> no, no, no. The fingers away. There we go. Okay. Just say it. Right there. Right there. <laughs> Yay. Hi, honey. Listen. I don't think that Sean and I need to tell you how great of a father you are. But we're going to anyway. Isn't that right? You are kind and loving <laughs> and funny. That's right. And patient. So patient. Patience of a saint, my mom used to say. Look. With Sean and us all being home together, it's been an amazing year. But even so, I know our best days are yet to come. In everything we do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Now, say goodbye, Sean. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Come on. That's sad, man. <laughs> bye, honey. I love you. Yes. That about takes care of that. Thank you. Can Sir. I... Can I come through? No? Yes? Now this, this is people's... Houses that you knew. Oh, no! I have to come back for that. But no more boy pins. Ugh. Codsworth. Sir, the missus and young Sean, they aren't here. Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't give up, sir. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well, the people there have only shot at me a few times. There's still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. You remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge, out of the neighborhood, and past the Red Rocket Station. I shall remain here and secure the home. 
Right. I thought we could help us, but I guess not. I think that's when we come back. There is there is a um, a little secret vault around here somewhere. Not a vault. It's a um, ah, here we go. Cellar. Cellar is the word I was looking for. That's a vault. I just hope some, there's some uh, bobby pins in there because I need some. I won't be able to access this. I can't do it. If I only had a bobby pin. Yeah, if only I had a bobby pin. I guess it's not going to give us one. Oh, I thought there'd be one down here. I guess not. That's sad. I can't believe they only gave us one bobby pin to start the game. That's crazy. Right, so I think we're going to leave it here, guys. In the next episode, we'll be traveling up to Concord. To see if we can get help, see if we can find Sean. If you like this video, please remember to like, subscribe and comment. Turn that notification bell on so you never miss an episode. And with that, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.